Sup, everybody? I am JDM8000. And I know some of y'all are saying, Oh, JDM, I thought you were done talking about Dan. Well, yeah, I am. Well, I just felt like, you know, remastering my vids on him, and maybe I could be the first one to make a movie about him. So, sit back, relax, grab whatever it is you feel comfortable eating, and enjoy this movie. Because they're legit bullying me! I hate that! Like, why would they want to do that to me? It's just a fucking opinion! Oh, boo-hoo! Let me play a sad song for you on the world's smallest violin. When I discovered Dan Stein's comment on Mike's latest video, he said this, Come to die. And I was like, dude, you got problems. Like, mental problems. And he asked me, Did I not see the Doctor Strange movie? And I was like, I mean, I saw the movie, but I seen clips of it. You genius. And I also called him retarded. Yeah. You're, yeah, Dan Stein, if you're watching this video, you're not just a hypocrite, you're also retarded. And he, and then he brings up Dormammu and says, that's something that Dormammu would say. For those who don't know Dormammu, he's a Marvel villain. And I was hoping that he can beat the crap out of him. I probably demolish him. And Dan Stein wanna be this low and says he can't. He's on a different plane of existence. Dude, it doesn't matter which kind of plane. He can still beat you. The comic book one and the MCU one. Both of them can beat you down easily. Simple as that. And Mike, if you're watching this, you'll definitely ag agree with me. And you also called him a twit. After Dan Stein was called a twit, he said, A twit is not really criticism. Dude, criticism has nothing to do with our conversation, man. Why are you changing it? Why? Why do you love putting, wor or putting certain words on Mike's mouth? Oh my god. God, you just need some help. You, you, you're just as bad as T Moss boss right now. You're, you're, you're just as bad as him. So that's, that's all I gotta say about you, Dan. I just wanna to, to enjoy Mike's video on you, his last video on you. All right, all right, guys. See you on the next video. Peace. Hello, everybody. I am JDM8000. And welcome to part two of Dan Stein's Retardation. If you haven't seen the previous part of his retardation, the link will be in the description. In part two, you will see nothing but screenshots. Screenshots will shock you and amaze you. As for the disclaimer, if you're a fan of him, I'm sorry to tell you this, but he's retarded and, and a hypocrite. That's my opinion on him. If you can't respect that, Dan Stein's fans, I recommend for you or says, or I suggest you just click away. And that out of the way, enjoy it. Dan Stein was published on September 23rd of 2012. And correct me if I'm wrong, I know this is too personal, but He's currently a middle school student, a middle school student, and he's 15. And um, my biggest question to Dan Stein is, 
how you're 15 and you're in the 7th grade. Or either you started school late, or probably you or you failed some of your class, uh, failed some of your grades. My guess is failed some of your grades. Anyway, back to the real topic. Oh, so, <clears throat> when I first heard of Dan Stein, I watched uh, Michael, Michael is his video, uh, which is more pointless Wolfie Chew rants. And for those who don't know Wolfie Chew, Wolfie Chew is a animatic slash animator. And to be honest, Wolfie Chew, if you're watching this video, I deeply feel bad for you. I know what's like to get picked on. Uh, um, as for me, I, 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 I also got picked on. Uh, then, then my years of um elementary school. Anyway, back to the real topic. So, Dan Stein. Danny Danny Stein. I'm going to talk about the beef between you and Mike. Why do you think that he was bothering you? Hmm? Why do you think that he's trying to bully you? His commentaries are meant for improvements, not for bullying. And why is that so hard for you to understand, man? Hmm? And, uh, and not to mention, you wanted him dead for some reason. I don't know why. And you also lie about him. Tell us, oh, my, Mike, Mike is bothering me. And, uh, ooh, 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 ooh. and you want to call um, Bennett, uh, Bennett? Uh, whatever his name is, Bennett, for help. Uh, they try to end um, my Michael is here's career. And look, look, I need your help. What do you exactly help with, Mike? My, my Mike is bothering me. How is he bothering you? He goes, oh, he won't stop bullying me. And Mike, I know you're extremely pissed at him for that. I couldn't blame you. I could not blame you. You have every reason and every right to feel pissed. Hmm. Hmm. And, um, Smash Pictures. In Smash Pictures, he was going to make a commentary on you. And I would like to see that in the near future. And... There's one thing I need to clear. He say criticism on every argument. Why is that? Why do you say it's not criticism? It's not criticism. Dude, Dan Stein, can you please, can you please stop using the word criticism every time you you're in an argument with somebody. Just stop doing that, man. And you think that criticism is bullying. And in your video, you said Wolfie Chu thinks that criticism is bullying. You thought the same thing, Dan. You obviously thought the same thing. Hmm. All I know is the hypocrisy of yours needs to stop. It really doesn't. It really doesn't need to stop because every time, every time you use the hip, every time you use the hypocrisy, you're digging yourself deeper and deeper and deeper to your own grave. You really are. And no wonder why Michael... And, and hopefully Mike, Mike, Mike is here. Please keep an eye on Dan Stein. Please keep an eye on him. He needs to be supervised. From now on. 
because he couldn't control his he couldn't control his hypocrisy. He couldn't. Either Mike is here or Smash Pictures. Please supervise him because he can't take care of himself around the internet. And and when I saw a okay when I published a part one of your retardation, you said and you said what if, what if I had the Infinity Stones? No one wouldn't care. Even if okay, let me tell you this: if Dan Stein, if you were on Infinity War, or or in any game, if if you were the main villain, if you were the main villain, the Avengers would take off that gauntlet and beat the snot out of you. They will constantly beat the snot out of you. And and he think uh, when I said good for you, he he actually thanked me. He thinks that he thinks I'm saying this in a good way. I said that in a bad way. And and he thought it was criticism. Like, dude, stop saying criticism. And he said it. And he was about to, and he was pissing me off at that. Guess what he said? Good. And I respond to him with, you know what? You made it a whole lot worse for yourself. All I know is, Dan Stein, you need to be off the internet. You you need to be off because you because two reasons: one, you couldn't control your hypocrisy, and two, you use, you use criticism on every argument. Look at that! Oh, I meant to say when I call him stupid, he said. Uh, 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 oh, oh. I mean, when I call him stupid, he said, "Stupid." When you call me stupid, it's not criticism. That's a that's what I meant to say. I made a mistake. Oh my! And the spellings, and the spellings. When he wrote "idiot," he replaced an "o" with a "p." Like, you need spelling classes. You need spelling classes. Didn't your teacher teach? Wait, uh, didn't your teacher told you how to spell? Because if don't, you you must have a bad teacher. <sighs> all right, that's all I gotta say about this this piece of crap. If you enjoy this rant, make sure you give a like, subscribe, share your thoughts on him, and share your thoughts on him in the comments below if you learn anything about him. And I'll see you guys on the next video. Peace out. What's up, everybody? I am JDM8000, and today I'm gonna have to come up, come up to Dan once again. Now, let me say this, this is my warm-up vid, my last vid on him will come up sometime now. Well, but anyway, enough of me talking, let's get started. I have an announcement to make. One announcement, some, 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 some lame announcement. Going to be making another video about Michael. Of course. But this video is going to be proving my claims on how he's trying to cancel me. Ain't nobody trying to cancel you. And if you are, if, and if you are trying to cancel you, all you have to do is just tell his fans to flag the stream when you try to raid him. So, yeah. But anyways, so many people have been getting irrationally upset 
over me making videos about Michael. And yeah, because you wouldn't leave this whole drama alone. And to be honest, I'm just going to have to say this. Guys, please chill. Because chill? Well, we're going to be chill if you just leave the dude alone. Of the fact being that these videos that I'm making aren't really hurting anyone. Except for Michael and his fans. Like, at the end of the day, I know what you guys are trying to do. You're trying to defend Michael. Yeah, because you know, yeah, he knows what he's talking about. And the and on quote unquote end of trauma or uh, drama, that's that's what we're doing. But to end the drama, you gotta be on my side. Because For what reason? You know, you do not want me to be all like, you know, upset and stuff. Like the reason why this drama has continued to February is because Michael apparently has an ego uh, to where he... You're the one to talk. ...believes that he could basically survive anything. And, and that's because of you guys defending him. Please stop defending him. Or what? And he'll only get more powerful if... Good. Good. We love, we love it when Mike is all powerful. That makes you even more weaker and weaker and weaker. The internet, mainly because of the fact being that, well, you guys are are making bad people out to be good, which is not okay. okay? Especially when it comes to people like Michael, who nearly be driven enemy to suicide. There's no way he he will drive you to suicide. Nobody should be able to remember that. I don't even think he has any remorse for what he almost did. So, please. Just like you, you don't have, you, you have no remorse uh, of what you did to his comment sections. Guys, you're, you're defending a psychopath. Coming from the person who wants to leave this drama alone. And the one who um spams people's comment sections. Yeah, he wants to quit because this is this, this getting way and way out of hand. It's just a comment. You will act like he's reporting it or spamming or flagging it. Oh, please. Anyway, enough crap from this dude. Dan, if you're watching this, get a life. Alright, guys, if you enjoyed this vid, give a like, subscribe. See you guys in the next video. Peace out. Whoo! Sup, everybody! I am JDM8000. And boy, oh boy! Dan Stein, thank you for giving me this moment to respond back to you. If you haven't seen my first um commentary on Dan, link will be in the link will be in the description. So let's see what he has to say about me. Boy, I'm just excited.
Am I quiet now? Huh? Am I quiet now? Like, for Christ's sake, at least I have an excuse for my audio problems. Like, for you, you have no excuse. Whatever. Like, really. For me, you know, it's, oh, I forgot to turn off the volume. For you, it's, oh, I forgot how to talk. Like, what the fuck? Assuming if your next video on me is gonna be the last video you make about me, because let's be honest, if he sees this, he's probably gonna respond to me. Yeah, you're right. You you darn right. I'm gonna respond to you, and I'm respond to, and I'm and I'm responding to you right now. You're not bullying Michael, uh, you're bullying Wolfie Chu by insulting her and attempting to dox her. Not true at all, but alright. But here's the a thing. How come um, I'm considered a bully when this exists? No, it's not that. He, he, he's just not tempted to take you down. And here's the thing. Me, on the other hand, I don't care about my reputation. How freaking sad. You want to know what I care about? All I care about is being successful in life. And you're doing a horrible job at it. Which makes you a very sad person. Because personally, I don't, I don't care about what people think of me. All I care about is just winning in the long run. That's it. You're never going to win in the long run because you're pathetic. Because he's my freaking friend. And you coming at him for no freaking reason. Like, really? I get it. it uh, you broke your deal. Well, here's the thing. Who cares? It's just a petty little deal Ill that we made on each other. Or just so uh, we could uh, leave each other alone. It's not some law-abiding contract that I have to follow or else I'm breaking the law. Like, seriously. And even if it was like that, I still because to Put that on silent. Be honest with you? Like, why would anyone want to respect Michael in the first place? He's that much of a, a horrible human being. No, that's you. And uh, people have every right to respect Michael. He is! He's fucking scum of the earth and I absolutely despise him. 
for the most stupidest reason. Again, he's my freaking friend, and you're coming at him for no freaking reason. You're almost acting like if this person is immune to criticism. Like, if you, like, here's the thing. If you criticize him, then apparently, oh, you're causing the apocalypse. Like, what, what the shit? Like, I can't talk about this person? And, and for what? Because of a deal? Like... Not even, like, a legal deal, which, granted, I still would have broken anyway. Which is not, which is not the surprise. But, really? Come on, man. It's not even that serious. Yep, it is. Says the one who be ho hollering about hollering about people bullying him. Care to elaborate on that point? Because no need. Here's the thing: if he truly knows what he's talking about, then why does he think that Wolfie Chu's voice? Is real. Not only that he thinks her voice is real, but he thinks that it's science that her voice is real. Science! Really? If it was truly a science that her voice is real, then here's the thing. I could easily think a voice is, is just like that. I can. Look, hi everyone, it's Wolfie Chewy. That that is the most horrible Woofy True person that I ever heard. I could easily, easily replicate that voice. Anyone can. And, and to be honest, it's the fact that you think that the fact that you think that he knows what he's talking about makes it look like that you don't know what you're talking about. Yeah, I do. Seriously, he thinks it's sci he thinks he's scientifically correct. He thinks he's a fucking genius. When he's not, he he's a retard. He he is the opposite of a retard. Yes, necessarily. Mainly because of the fact being that, well, I feel the need to defend myself. And if I don't defend myself, then, you know, I'll eventually lose. Good. B b b because you're nothing but a loser. Because then that means his reputation would keep on getting higher and higher. And I don't want that to happen, so... Yet, oh, wait. How you don't care about your own reputation yet, but you're destroying someone else's? Like, does that make sense to you, Dan? I need to fight back, defend myself, you know? So, if you join me, I won't have to fight back and defend myself, and this drama would be over, okay? Because the fact is, is that. 
Uh, pretty much most of them, most, m m m it's, yeah, especially the one, uh, especially the videos about Michael. You showed that you have an ego problem. Let me uh, uh let me answer my own question. Absolutely nothing. Good. Yeah, but here's the thing. That's not good. Yes, it is good because you're pathetic. But you and toxicity have a lot in common. Oh, uh, which is you know um good. Oh, uh, which is um de uh, destroying people. Nothing, but you coming after my friend and, and then make him look bad. That kind of, you know, bothers me. Because, as far as I'm aware, I've barely done anything to you in particular. So, yeah. Like, th this is literally the only reason why he's defending me. Because he wants me. Here you, here you go again. Well, whatever that is. Put that on silent. Be weak. I just don't get it. Of course you don't get it. Blah, 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 blah. So do you. Came a bad person. You're the one to talk. At least Michael 
doesn't dogs peep doesn't dogs anyone he, that he hates Weren't you even listening? I said, you had no remorse of what you did to his comic sections. Oh. For doing what they did in World War II, which they shouldn't have remorse for what they did in World War II, mainly because of the facts being that what they did in World mm -hmm. War II were completely justified. What you So let me get this straight. So me bringing back a drama makes me a psychopath. What? And also, you doxing someone that you hate makes you a psychopath. It doesn't even make any sense. I mean, really. Let's just be for real for one moment. If you think that people who are psychotic would bring back drama and that's like the worst thing that they would do then honestly seems like that you might be the one who's psychotic either that or you're just dumb at least I don't dox pe uh, at least I don't go out of my way to dox people that I hate That's what I'm saying. Um, you can't be making assumptions like that, especially if they're wrong. Alright, final thoughts. What do I think of this video? What? I, I could care less what you think about this video. Think about that video. Anyway, I think I said enough. If you enjoyed this vid, give a like, sub, See you guys in the next video. Peace out. Sup, everybody. I am JDM8000. And today, I will be making my final, my absolute final message on Dan Stein. Because there's no point of trying to, you know, reason with him, talking to him. Knowing that he's not gonna, he's knowing that he's not gonna listen and try to be arrogant. So without further ado, sit back and relax and enjoy this message. Dan, let me say this: I don't hate you at all. I just hate your actions, and I don't like none of them. So, question: What is your beef with Wolfie Chu? Even though she, she never met you, you never met her, so her voice isn't fake. 
It's actually real. Stop assuming it, please. And the title, Movie True Must Die. That's, that's one thing I do not like about that bit, is the title. That, the title is way, way too personal. So, let's talk about the feud between you, you and my main man, Michael. That's how I met you. That's how I first met you. Because of Michael. And stop. Stop assuming that he's trying to quote unquote cancel you. When he isn't. He isn't. You're canceling yourself. Hmm. And stop using death in general as an excuse. And let's talk about the two vids that you made on me. First part of the vid that I agree on is when I should have elaborated on the point when I said Michael knew that he was talking what it was talking about. What I mean by that is when he knows how arrogant, stupid, and immature he is. So there, I elaborated on that point. There you go. The rest of that vid, I disagree with. On the second vid you made on me, I was kind of wrong. You you probably didn't actually thought, sir. And my 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 apologies for accusing you like that. The rest of it I disagree with. And you're right, Dan. You're right. Toxicity should never win. But you and toxicity have a lot in common. Which is destroying others. That's exactly what you're doing, Dan. So, so on a second minute, on the ending, you say yourself you want to distance yourself from this drama, and you're tired of it. I remember. But yet, you just resurrected it. You resurrected it. And yeah, uh, about that marathon about Michael, it's very, very suckish. And I hope it ends a lot faster. So, yeah, those are my messages. Dan, please leave this drama alone. Dan, get a life. Like, what are you doing with yourself? And... Stop using death as an excuse. Stop assuming that what Wolverine's voice is fake was actually real. Stop or stop assuming that Michael's trying to cancel you when you're canceling yourself. Okay. Oh wait. That's one thing I forgot to mention. When you comment on vids, correct your spelling. Just like, 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 one question for you. How horrible that you do, huh? how horrible that you did on a spelling test? How horrible that you did on a spelling bee? I mean, if you were on a spelling bee, but, yeah. And another thing I forgot to mention. On that apology vid, on, on, on the very beginning, I actually thought that you were talking to but I honestly thought that you were about to apologize to Michael. I thought that was the miracle. But yet, you apologize for something else. I mean, what should you really mainly be apologizing for is when, is, is when you assume that Michael's trying to cancel you. And the other dumb, dumb crap that you did. And so, at the end of the day, Dan, get a life, seek some professional help, and approve as a person. Please, do everyone on the internet that favor. Okay, I'm done. Peace. That's the end of this movie, guys. I hope y'all enjoyed it. So, let me say a few things before I actually end this movie. Don't make too many videos on him. I highly don't recommend that.
because he's not going to listen. He's not going to change. He's not going to improve as a content creator. He, 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 will, he will choose to be arrogant and ignorant and stupid. All, all in the same freaking time. Anyway, I'm officially done with this dude. He is a piece of work. Alrighty, guys. So, Michael is here. More like Michael is dumb. Oh, get wrecked. That was the coolest insult ever. That, that me and my grandfather had a plan to get my channel monetized so Michael could stop trying to cancel me. But it turns out that he's going to continue doing that because he wants me to fail. And he's trying to get me to never make any money ever on YouTube. Why the fuck you lying? Why you always lying? Mm, oh my god. Stop fucking lying.